Glastonbury Festival 2024 is still shrouded in mystery, but fans may have just got their first clue as to who is going to be headlining next year. The full lineup of the annual event is usually revealed by around the end of May, but the first clues to 2024's collection of artists has just been dropped by the festival's organizer, Emily Evis. She recently appeared on the latest episode of Annie McManus and Nick Grimshaw's podcast, Sidetracked with Annie and Nick. In it, she said of the lineup, 2024 is still a little up in the air. And I thought it was kind of taking shape and then last week I just got a call, and this is what happens if you wait a little longer, because quite often we'll be booked up from July. She went on to confirm a major artist became interested in joining the lineup. Evis said, this year we're holding out for a little bit longer and last week I got a call from a really big American artist saying this person's around next year. And I was like, oh my god, this is incredible. Thank god we held the slot. For Glastonbury Festival 2023, a major American female artist was said to be taking on the headline slot over the weekend, but she was unfortunately forced to pull out at the last minute. As a result, she was replaced by Guns N' Roses, Evis confirmed. I've always been really passionate about gender split, on festival lineups, she said. And I think actually, our problem was that I'd been so outspoken about it that having a year where there wasn't a female sent people a bit mad, or some people. Evis confirmed they did have a female artist for this year. She pulled out, she added. And we replaced them with guns, in roses, on the Saturday. But everyone who knows, knows that it's top of my list. I'm always trying to make it the most balanced, diverse bill. This artist was heavily rumored to be Taylor Swift, however, nothing was ever confirmed. Evis added, it is difficult with female artists because there aren't enough headliners. But we're also creating them. We're putting the bands and female artists on smaller stages and bringing them through all the time so I feel like the pool is going to be bigger soon. And who knows next year we might get two. And certainly I can say that the legend is female. Listen to Sidetracked here.